Do not get your nipples pierced while you're pregnant. Do not get your nipples pierced during breastfeeding. Hello, YouTube. It's your girl, T. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Super Blessed. Today, I am going to be talking to you guys about nipple piercings and breastfeeding. So, we're going to get to it, huh? We're going to let everybody know. Say hello. <laughs> okay bye bye we're going to um let everybody know all the truths about having your nipple pierced while breastfeeding so i'm not only going to just let you know about as you guys know i am not a lactation consultant because i am not a specialist of any sort or a doctor i am literally just a mama who have had experiences in this circumstance and I feel like I just want to share with you guys all the research that I've come across and all the experiences that I have had being that I have myself had my nipple pierced as well the simple answer is if it's possible is yes it is totally fine you are still likely able to breastfeed after having your nipples pierced if you are a person who scar easily there is a great chance that you may have scar tissue in between your piercing that leads to the end where the milk comes out which is your nipple pore. Luckily you do have two breasts so breastfeeding definitely would have been a lot easier had I not had that piercing. I do believe that there was minor scarring in my other breast and that did cause me to have a little bit of issues with getting milk to come out of one of my breasts. If that was to be the situation for you you could totally just breastfeed with one breast. You can you don't necessarily have to use both, but obviously having both breasts accessible makes things easier and not to mention afterwards you won't have to worry about your breast being asymmetrical. I think I know that is something at the end of the day I do worry about because I do want to still enjoy my body after breastfeeding. However, my most important concern is giving my giving my baby the, the best nutrition that I could give her. So now I'm gonna get more into the experience of what it's like to have your nipples pierced. Do not get your nipples pierced while you're pregnant. Do not get your nipples pierced during breastfeeding. While I was pregnant, I had had my nipples pierced for maybe six years at this point. But despite that, I did have to take them out. I tried everything I could in my power to not have to take them out. I got larger, um, longer bars. It Nothing really helped because what would happen is the the barbell or the balls, they would lay on my skin and then my skin started to kind of like erode or whatever, kind of like a bad sore. So that was happening with my skin. Um, and so I decided to just do away with the um, nipples piercings at about six months because your nipples are getting larger. You may be able to still manage keeping your nipple ring in some way, somehow. However, I was not able to do that. If I wanted to like kind of keep my holes open and stuff now that I've had her, my nipples are still pretty big, but for whatever reason, I still wanted to like keep my holes open. The best thing for you to do is to take them out while breastfeeding. You can put them back in, but I've heard that it's a, it's a hassle to have to do, and you just want to make sure that you're keeping everything clean and sterile if you're going to be doing that, well, especially while you're feeding your precious baby. So it's totally up to you, but do not, I repeat, do not feed the baby with the jewelry in because it could roll off and then they'll be choking on it. And that kind of goes hand in hand because you obviously would have to take it out every single time you feed. It would be pointless for you to get your nipples pierced and a fresh hole will cause um, many different infections. So. If you're eager to get your nipples pierced and you decide you're gonna breastfeed, you're either gonna to have to choose one or the other because you're not gonna be able to breastfeed on a healing piercing. I mean, I think that's pretty obvious, but you know. I've talked about the scar tissue that would restrict the flow of your milk, which is what I experienced. So I'm gonna talk about your holes still remaining open. If your holes still remain open, they don't close up, or even if there's not any scar tissue, you may experience milk coming out of all 
of your holes, including your nipple piercings. So you might see milk, of course, coming out of your nipple pores, but they might also seep out of the side of your nipples where your piercings are. And that is totally normal. The only issue that you may see with that is the baby may choke on that and it's not anything to worry about but the flow might be a little bit more heavier than the baby can keep up with so that is something to keep in mind also whenever you have your nipples pierced but yeah i think that is all for you guys i thank you for watching this video i hope it was super super helpful for you and as i always say i hope your life is filled with more blessings and less stressing Bye.